Hello guys. So in this video, we will be working with binary tree paths problem from lit code. So basically this problem suggests we have to return all the paths from root node to the lit nodes. In, so in this given example, we have two paths that is one, two, five, and then one, three. As you can see, the output format should be in like this. All right, this is kind of like very easy. Uh, easy question when you uh, like you you just need to traverse the traverse the tree in any order but you need to make sure that you need to make sure that you are keeping the path that you followed like you are keeping the track of the nodes you had followed before so for that we will be taking a different variable like suppose we take a path variable and we will keep at, uh, appending that uh, variable like creating that variable such that whenever we visit one we will add with one and then two two but since left node is null we don't add that and then we go to five so all right let's get on to it so if root is null we know that we don't have to do anything and it is an empty list that needs to be returned i'll take another function inside it define three parts so that for now let's suppose I'm taking this nodes and then at the end I will do return three parts root so as I mentioned earlier we have to keep track of the nodes that we have already traversed I'll take a take a variable called path that is current path you can take a current path variable as well and then I'll take a response list that I need to send re return to this function so that it can return to the main function now we uh, for we will be creating first path with the root node right so this will be the syntax for that uh, make sure you you uh, know that this particular syntax is only valid for Python 3 if you are using Python just Python you won't be able to use that syntax so in that order you can just create a variable here and use that here all right so this is first this is path and then we have response all right if not node we know that it's we have hit a uh, none node we can just return response now the real question, real base case is whenever we hit a leaf node we know that we have got the path and we can append that to the response so if not node dot left and not node dot right return rest sorry after that we we know we have found the path so we will append the path to the rest and we return the response now if node dot left we will be calling the tree paths on the left node node dot left and we will be creating the path here path plus yeah and here we will be adding the nodes value node dot left dot value so if I didn't use the node dot left condition here, this line will throw an error as suppose if I, if the node has a value, suppose we come to uh, like two, and we have we send we are sending the node dot left, but while creating the path we are taking the node dot left dot value right. If we if we do that, this line will throw an error if this condition is not there. So that's why I'm taking if node dot left. It will make sure that this node dot left that wall val always create a uh, definitive path in here 
and it won't throw any error as mentioned earlier this this is this syntax is particular to five, python 3 if you are using python 2 you can create this variables uh, before here so, and something called suppose temporary path and then add it here make sure you are not you are not uh, changing this path variable because if you did uh, if you change the path here that path will be changed for the next recursive call that is for the node dot write as well and it will un unnecessarily involve different nodes in that path which we don't want so we will be just adding path here and then rest now we will do the same for write node right that's it written dress let's see what it shows 1251313 all right let's submit it it's accept all right guys so this is the code for binary tree paths thank you